Hello friends, this video on magnetic effects of current part 1 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Topics to be covered in this lesson are History of magnetism Bar magnet Magnetic field Oersted's experiment Magnetic field lines Magnetic field due to a current carrying conductor Force on a current carrying conductor due to magnetic field Electric motor Electromagnetic induction and electric generator. So to start with this lesson on magnetic effects of current, we would like to see uh, why are we studying this lesson. As we always do in every lesson, we would just like to have an introduction screen which will tell us some of the important things in our day-to-day -day life which we come across or some of the important applications of this magnetism. Some of them are, you would have seen that nails get attracted towards a magnet. The magnetic compass, it is a very, uh, it's, it's a small but very significant instrument. It helps us to find out direction. It has a needle. You would have seen this in your physics laboratories or maybe some of you would have, you'd be having it even at your homes. So it is a small circular needle like thing which has a needle which will always point in the north-south direction. So that is how it helps us to determine the direction. In your refrigerators, if you see the doors of the refrigerators, they have got some magnetic effect because of which the doors get locked. Not only that, the screwdrivers which you use, that also has got the effects of magnetism because of which it attracts nails. The metro rails, the railway tracks on which your rail runs or even the doors on your metro, they all use this phenomenon of magnetism. Not only that, even your electric motors and generators are application of the same. So these are some of the applications of magnetism. Not only these, but there are several other examples as well. But I just try to give, mention some of them so that you get an idea of what are we going to study. So let us see how did this idea of magnetism came into picture? From where did this magnetism actually evolve? It happened a long time back, somewhere around Turkey, that the shepherd found that there were some rocks which attracted nails. They discovered it by chance. I mean, they used to go there and suddenly they observed that there were some special kind of rocks which has the capacity to attract nails. So what happened during that time, there was nothing called magnetism actually existed. So people thought that those rocks were magical and that is, it was a magical effect that they uh, attract nails and they called those rocks as magnesia because they thought they were magical rocks. So the magical rocks were named as magnesia. Later with the development of science, scientists were able to discover this phenomenon of magnetism wherein a substance has a capability of attracting certain materials towards itself. So later magnetism was developed. And then it was found that whenever a magnet is left to itself, it always aligns itself in the north-south direction. So with this much idea on magnetism, it was found again that somewhere, um, somewhere during those early years, some, chi some Chinese war took place and during that war, this, this property of magnets was extremely useful. That is, it helps us, it, it aligns itself in the north-south direction. So this property of magnet was used in order to find out the direction. During the Chinese wars, the ship used compass needle, the magnetic compass which I was talking about in the previous slide. So they used those magnetic compass uh, which helped it to point towards the direction. Right? So these were similarly in one of those earlier days, there was some king who was able to win. I mean, who was able to win a war because of the use of this magnet. I mean, if you look at the first picture, the chariot had a small magnet attached to it which, or, which pointed towards the direction where it had to attack. So these kind of things were there in those earlier days and that is how gradually magnetism evolved. And then it was found that not only this but there was several other phenomena related to magnetism.
Thank you. Please visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thank you once again.